Let's make one of these. Wait, what? How do you make how do you make a lever? A lever. Hey everyone, Jeremy here. Uh, it's been a minute, but I made this video like a month ago and I never got to finishing it. So here we are. Thought I'd throw up another poll day video um, just cause I haven't posted anything in a while. This was one that I did um, before I started my bulk. So I was actually able to hold my lever holds a lot longer. I looked a lot more um, toned in this video but currently i am in the middle of a bulk i think since the last time i checked my weight which was around this time i was like 132 and it's like what mid-january now and i am at like 138 so gained some and uh, i forgot what my goal was i think i'm just trying to get to 140 maybe and then i'm gonna start i'm gonna go into a mini cut and then i'm gonna try to maintain that for the rest of spring and the summer. As you can see, I'm kind of just doing my usual um, calisthenics lever routine at the beginning of my workout for like 30 minutes. I think I went over this in another video. That's why I'm not really uh, going over it in much detail. Uh, if you want to know more about that and exactly what I do, just feel free to check those videos out. Uh, I go into my more kind of rep intensive workouts so that kind of just revolves around like getting my pull-ups in especially like trying to build towards that strength for a one-arm pull-up so i did some band assisted ones there in general for each of these i do about three to four sets depending on the exercise i do four sets of four on each side for the one arm and then for this one i do about three sets of 10 uh l sit pull-ups and that's just kind of what I do for pull day. A little bit of some physique profiles, just because I thought I was looking pretty smacking after my pump from a pull day. Uh, but other than that, that's the end of my video. If you liked today's video, please like and subscribe. Uh, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.